What's good, Post family? Don't y'all like free? I love free, right? So, here we are today. Native Instruments came out with a super cool new VST plugin, and it's in association with one of our own. And this was called Jacob Collier's Audience Choir. It is super fun, super dope. But you guys keep it locked. Stay tuned. This is based off of when he did his tour in 2002, where he went all over the world to Jesse, and uh, they basically took the audience's, you know, sounds. He took the audience sounds, and every way he went, he just recorded. So let's just go over what the free instrument actually entails. It relives the magic of Jake McCauley at the SC's world tour by conducting your very own audience choir. It blends vowels, captures from different cities, and adds a unique percussion with stomps, claps, and snaps. You can record your very own custom XY pad motions and add depth with a polyphonic aftertouch support. I want to go ahead and dive directly into the VST because it really, really is cool. And don't forget, if you guys want to cop this, it is free. So drop down to the link in the description and get it now. There is no limit on this. All right. So on this left hand top corner right here is the actual chord generator. This is how you turn it on and off where you can play actual chords. This is where you can go and then pick the key of that. And then you could change from either major to minor to harmonic minor. This right here is where you go to change your vowel sounds. Now, on the actual, uh, the, the matrix right here is where you will see those sounds move. And as we go through the progression of this actual review, I'll show you guys how it works. But you have the options here where it goes from A, 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 all the way down to a user preset. Over here is where when you actually play the sounds, it shows where that sound was actually recorded, which is very, very fun. Um, but if you wanted to turn it off, there is a button right here that you click and you can go and turn off your animations. Now, you can also do the fine tuning and because I don't have nothing up right now, we're not tuning anything, but uh, you can tune it. You can actually change the pitch bend and you can do a vowel morph pad. And that's what we were talking about on the X and Y axis. All right. Now at the very bottom right here, you have the dynamic, the amount of how much you can go up and down. You have the triad blend from major to minor. And then you have the timbral, the delay, your reverb, your stereo from left to right, how much you want it to be your attack and your release. Now, one thing uh, as far as when you're playing with the choir, and it's actually better with the chord generator on. So right here, this little play button right here, this is the actual vowel morph uh, play button that activates, like you have your automatic movements and stuff on this matrix. So if you turn it off, So if you wanted to play it where the matrix moves and let's say we wanted to do just a loop. So the loop you have either forward, backwards, forward, backwards or backwards, forward. And we're just going to do forward, backward. Right. And then I'm going to hit play. So it goes in that motion. So you see it says A, E, O and then back to A. But if you wanted to do like a full circle. When you turn on the chord generator, and let's say you want to do full circle again, you'll hear an actual chord being played by one note. Um, that's pretty much it for this free VST. It is a real, real cool one. And like I said, Jacob is one of our own. Very excited to have just a piece of his, you know, collection. Not too many people do this and to record your audience like that's super dope, man. Just to get the sounds from it. I wanted to go over the quick little beat that I made from it. So uh, let me know what you guys think about the beat.
much, Jacob. And Native Instruments, greatly appreciate this cool, cool instrument, man. Uh, again, ladies and gentlemen, it is free to download. There is no limited time on getting this. If you guys like this video, please make sure that you drop down, hit a like, hit a comment. Also, let me know what you guys think about the new VST that Native Instruments has released. Um, there are a lot of other things that I'm working on, so please just make sure that you stay tuned to the channel. There's a lot coming up. It really is. I've been super, super busy. Another one done. Another one in the books. You guys already know who it is. It is your boy, Thesis. Peace.